Hey everyone, I'm Kaylin, a second year software engineering major and entrepreneurship minor, and I'm your VP of tours for this year. As you can see, I live in the beautiful Aloha State, Hawaii, and today I'm going to teach you some pigeon. So what is pigeon? You might be thinking about the bird, but it's so much more than that. Pigeon is a local slang that was developed in the 1800s when Hawaii was a plantation town. People from all over the world came to Hawaii to work in these plantation farms, and they didn't know each other's languages. You might be wondering how these people communicated with each other, and the answer is pidgin. As people spoke in their native tongue, some common terms came about, which we now know today as pidgin. Pidgin is a mix of languages, including Hawaiian, Portuguese, Japanese, Chinese, Filipino, Korean, Okinawan, Spanish, and Puerto Rican. Okay, so we're going to start off with a few Hawaiian pidgin greetings. Aloha. What's up? How's it? What's up, brah? Hey, you. The first word I want to teach you guys is the kind. The kind is our all-purpose word that can be said for everything. The meaning depends on the context of the situation. I can say, you know, the kind, or she went the kind over there. It's just kind of a, you know, context thing. It depends. I mean, you could use the kind three times in a sentence. Uh, she went the kind that the kind over there because she the kind, you know? So, the kind. I know what you guys might be thinking. Caleb, hey, Caleb, is it talking to you? Listen, hey, let me choke your neck. And you're wrong. Thankfully, that's not the pigeon meaning of choke. Choke actually means a lot. Like, there's choke food or there's choke people. So make sure you use the word choke properly, yeah? Not suffocating, but as in plenty. As some of you know, I really enjoy cooking, so I thought I would share with you guys some pigeon words related to food. Another word for food is grinds, G-R-I-N-D-Z. This is referred to like, we've got good grinds, or the grinds here are super good. Uh, the second word is poopoos. Poopoos is another word for appetizers. So um, anything small or, you know, the things you eat before you start your meal, we refer to as poopoos. So... Um, if you guys are familiar with poke or dips or that kind of things, we would say, oh, you know, there's poo-poos over there or go eat some of the poo-poos before dinner. The third word is palhana, and this means like happy hour. So like how you have a happy hour where you sit down and relax and maybe sip a glass of wine or something. We like to say, oh, it's palhana hour or oh, it's time to relax and go palhana. The last word is ono, meaning delicious. So you can say the food's very ono or, ooh, that looks ono. So the next time you're at a party, make sure to try out these food words. And before we go, here's some pigeon goodbyes. Laters. Kaden. Thanks, bro. Shoots. Mahalos. Okay. Thanks, huh? See you. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys learned something new about pigeon and enjoyed it. Thank you so much for giving it a watch. Once again, I'm Kaylin Gu, your VP of Tours. And if you want to learn more about Pigeon or hear more about my Hawaii life, feel free to reach out. I'm excited to get to know you guys. Take care. Shoots.